Hi, this is Brad SharpensBest.com. How you doing today? Uh, out here doing some reviews on some products and uh, then we're going to put them on the website. One-of-a-kind hatchet here. Uh, it's not a one-of-a-kind hatchet, but it's a one-of-a-kind because it's going to be one that I sharpened. Did a review on and uh, it's a Schrade. Okay, and I'll hold still so you can see the name and the number on it there. Schrade. It's actually a pretty nice feeling little hatchet and uh, it's cast, cast steel. Okay, and then they uh, machined the side of it and everything. Uh, it's got pretty good weight to the head. Feels pretty good. Um, I like uh, I like the hatchet. It's got a rubber handle on it. It's not too big. It's got enough weight to actually chop and split. It's got the back, the hammer part here. That would be a good deal. It does have a lanyard for your uh, hand to go through so that you, when you hang on to it, maybe your hands are cold, maybe you slip a little bit. Whatever happens, it doesn't go flying because it's got the lanyard uh, to put your hand through. Um, it's actually it's got a, a fairly wide blade it's not a, a real cheap made at all it's it comes down to a pretty good edge right there and let's check and see what we got for sharp okay that's pretty good Ooh. get it uh, tease it along there okay that's not that's not too bad but you do have to work with a little bit so I think what I'm going to do with this one is I'm going to use my poker chip one. Why? Because that would be the one that I would most apt to have with me out in the woods if I'm hunting, hiking, camping, out, you know, survival situation. Maybe I'm working out in the woods, things like that. So I would have this one with me. It takes up no room. It, it weighs, I don't know, a quarter of an ounce. Uh, so that's pretty cool. They don't break, wear out, come apart, fit right in your pocket, all that stuff. So we'll just do this. We're going to match the bevel out here on the... Oop, I'm getting bit. Mosquitoes. All right, so match the uh, cutting edge out here like that, the bevel. Turn it a little bit. And then we're just going to brush along like this. I'm going to cover up the point with my finger. Otherwise, it kind of goes off of the point there and doesn't work right. And then we just go right on around. Don't push too hard. Quarter to half an ounce of pressure. Slide it right on around. You can turn it over and come back this way, go out this way, come back this way. You can start here and just go in full length motions just like that. Okay, then turn it over and do the same thing. Work on this side, let it bump my thumb, and then go right on out. Do the same thing again. Okay, I'm going to turn it over, and then just like this, light pressure. I'm only talking, you know, quarter to half an ounce of pressure, just like that. Ooh, bugs. All right, and then we're going to touch it really light, flipping it every pass, just like that. Don't press too hard on it. Let it work. Don't make it work. All right, drop that down there. Take my paper. Not so much... Uh, making it cut now not so much teasing it along pretty much just cutting go to my website sharpensbest.com take a look we're going to have some knives there this hatchet uh, these are the knives that i bought at outdoor world otherwise maybe known as bass pro shop um, go to sharpensbest.com take a look you'll see the price there buy the knives and the hatchet buy this one of a kind sharpened by brad buckner hatchet Shrade. take care